coffee revolution in 1986. And how, my goodness, has it grown now? 36 years later, you do not need to have barista skills to create a premium cup of coffee. All you need is Nespresso. When we launched Nespresso here in the Philippines, we already known that at some point we had to be here in Cebu. Cebu being a key market for us, obviously. And so finally, after several years, um, it's here, we're here, and we are very happy and excited. Um, we are, by the way, a company called Novatour Coffee Concepts Inc. And we are the official partner of Nespresso in the Philippines. And let me tell you, we cannot be any prouder um, to represent such a brand that is at the forefront of innovation, quality, and sustainability. And we believe that these values are also the same values that um, Cebu lives by. To bring the discerning Cebuano market elevated coffee experiences conveniently and consistently in the comfort of their own space. So whether that space be inside of their homes, in their offices, or anywhere practically. Um, our commitment towards sustainability with the recycling program that we have, as well the work that we do with the farmers that is uh, highlighted a little bit with the window to farm that we have over there. Then we have the coffee quality and that can be shown by the coffee tasting that we provide. And finally, and that's the most important for me, it is the service. So the service given by the staff, the coffee specialists as we call them, and the passion that they have. And, uh, and we believe with the service and the storytelling that they are able to uh, provide to our customers, differentiate us among the coffee industry. So that's why a boutique is extremely important and we are very proud to open this boutique here in Miami Center City. So obviously our first boutique entree from the middle shows the growing demand for upscale, premium quality places like coffee. And when we opened a month ago, you can see the, uh, the demand. Uh, there's a lot of people. The first thing we would be receiving pictures and videos from Adela on the reception. So we really appreciate the Sabanos uh, taking, uh, welcoming uh, the Espresso brand warmly. So there's a lot of enthusiasm. In fact, uh, we were discussing a while ago that the, for now, the difference that we see is that more the higher tier machines Especially if are being uh, demanded, being uh, purchased. So that's what we see. Even our accessories, our dispensers. So our demand planners have to go back and say, okay, first of all, when it comes to high tier machines, the demand is really such a unusual volume uh, as compared to other boutiques in the middle. And as you know, we have over right here is our recycling area where an espresso to be recycled into products like perhaps bicycles or laptop parts, houseware items, and also repurposed by our partner. And they chose, I think, the very classic and very basic pieces, which is the Lola. You know, it's just like grass, represents coffee. Uh, that lamp up there is a new lamp called uh, Diwa, and it has those uh, Ifugao gods, you know, which are the, the, the spirits of the hills, you know, which is where coffee comes from. And uh, that over there is a uh, little people's screen, which is uh, inspired by the Filipino Bayanina uh, spirit. And so uh, I think the pieces are very uh, appropriate, and the team uh, chose well. And I think to myself, what a wonderful world. What a wonderful world